because here's former First Lady Michelle Obama playing the race card while speaking at the Obama Foundation Summit held in Illinois, at, held in Chicago rather, at the Illinois Institute of Technology. She describes how she first became conscious of white flight. And she wants to remind white folks that, as I quote her, y'all were running from us and you're still running. Take a listen to this. Upstanding families like ours, you know, who were doing everything we were supposed to do and better. Um, as we moved in, uh, white folks moved out because they were afraid of what our families represented. And I always stop there when I talk about this out out in the world because, you know, I want to remind white folks that y'all were running, running from us, <laughs> you know, because... This family. This family. Yeah. <laughs> this family, <laughs> with all the values that you read about, yeah. you were running from us, and you're still running. You know, I, I just, I see this, and I hear this, and I go, is it disconnect, or is it really just about maintaining power, Giano? Because economic flight is what drives it. If a black man could afford to leave a, a bad neighborhood or a black woman could afford to leave a bad neighborhood, they do that. We see this all across America. But here we see the race baiting game. And this is what happens. And I'm going to call it what it is. She's being a race pimp in today's society. You know, I, I, I hear the, the sot, the sound on tape. And I wonder if she has any facts to support her conclusion that um, simply because they were there, the uh, white Americans were leaving the community because they didn't like what their family represented, which was her quote. I don't know of any facts to support their narrative whatsoever. And I think to make a statement like that without a message about uniting us, and what it is is really divisive and you're looking to divide us based on race. It's problematic. And I don't know of any data to support her saying they're still running. Like, I, I don't know where that comes from. Now, if you're talking about in the city of Chicago, I can see that being the case because people are running out of the city of Chicago in droves in fear of their lives being taken away, um, in fear of taxes being raised on them, taxes and fees, in fear of a liberal government that continues to chase its citizens and take everything that they have. So maybe there is some truth to that point, but that wasn't the narrative in which she was making it through. 